everyone. My name is Noena Ayu, and I am here on behalf of the fabulous candidate, Spencer Booser. Spencer is running for Secretary of SGA, and I can honestly say that there is no better candidate for the job. Throughout his time at Coleman High School, Spencer has demonstrated leadership skills and participated in many school activities. <laughs> Remix! <laughs> Faculty, students, and parents, too. I'm going to kick it one time booster style for you. He's running for Secretary of SGA, and we're asking for your vote in this elaborate way. I want to take a minute or two and give much respect to the guy with you in mind. His name is Spencer Boozer, and he's no loser. A better candidate you will not find. You can count on Spencer to have your back, and he's never disrespectful. His mama taught him that. He's a smart kind of athlete with a really good rep and a record the meetings step by step. He's smooth like silk, the kind of guy that I chase. He's got a body like Arnold and a Brad Pitt face. <laughs> service and life guards for fun. Now don't get me wrong, he's far from a bore. So listen real close and I'll tell you some more. He'll serve you up right with his mad tennis skills and he makes the ladies fall for him head over heels. He's trustworthy and honorable, that's no lie. The Leo Club secretary and a super fly guy. So ladies and gents, make the right choice and make Spencer Vision the student's voice. Wiki wiki word. <laughs> Thank you, Noe. <laughs> <laughs> Students, administrators, and teachers. My name is Spencer Bridger, and I'm a junior running for SGA Secretary for the 2008-2009 school year. I want to become your SGA Secretary because not only would it be a great privilege to serve you, but we need one. Imagine the SGA without a secretary. Records would be lost, mail would pile up, and no one would have a clue as to what's going on in the world. Scary as it seems, there's no need to worry. You have the choice to elect a secretary, such as myself, to keep everything in order. Some examples of secretarial duties I would have would be taking attendance, recording the minutes, and handling all correspondence for the SGA. I feel that I'm well qualified for these tasks. Why, you might ask? Well, when it comes to recording the minutes, everyone can tell time, so how hard would that be? And taking attendance, I'll keep it in check. When it comes to handling the mail, I've got two hands for that. As a current member of Coleman County's Youth Leadership class, I'll put my leadership qualities to work for you. I'll keep accurate minutes and record all pertinent information to keep you informed of the latest news from the SGA meetings. Also, as secretary, I'll have to write a lot. My penmanship is better than your average fifth grader and can easily be read by me. <laughs> If elected, I promise to represent this school and always voice the opinions of my peers. If you have any suggestions for change around the school, I'm easy to get in touch with. I'm here five days a week, eight until three, and I will strive to meet your needs. Thank you for your attention, and remember, don't be a loser, vote for Boozer, and I will appreciate your vote. Thank you. Good morning, CHS. I'm Sean Cecil, and I'm here to tell you why you should vote for Amy O'Dell as your next SGA secretary. For the job of secretary, there are many responsibilities that one must have. Amy not only has these characteristics of a secretary, but she puts them to use in her everyday life. She will be the one who listens to the SGA body, to the student body. To explain to you why, she, why you should vote for Amy, I have spelled out her name on the scrubby. She's amazing. She was able to get the vote from Chuck Norris. She's a musician. She plays both the drums and the guitar. But why not? Nobody else is more qualified for her than this job, for this job. She's objective. She doesn't care what anyone thinks of her and is willing to share her view. She's a diver. She swims a lot, so you could say she overcame the power of water. She has experience. With three years of experience in SGA, she knows what needs to be done. She listens. She'll always be there to listen to your voice and will listen to everything you say. She's a lifesaver. She's always known how to save a life. <laughs> So as you leave and go to home road and vote, be sure to mark Odell. And when you cast your vote, just remember, dude, you're getting Odell. <laughs> hey. My name is Orton Lee. I'm asking for you to support our figures as vice president for SGA. All of you may know him as you should, but if you're in that hand, you are 
You know, he is dedicated, high motivated student, athlete, friend, and leader. <laughs> so make sure you vote for Cook. He shouldn't have trouble remembering the name since he's all on the ballot for vice president. But so anyway, he'll be glad to know he has his support. Vote hard for for vice president. He'll be glad you did. Thanks. <laughs> CHS administrators, faculty, and fellow students. My name is Tyler Sugars, and I'm running for Vice President of Student Government Association. As I approach my senior year, I look forward to the chance to serve you while striving for another outstanding year at Coleman High School. I have been in SGA for three years while also serving as Vice President of my class during the 9th, 10th, and 11th grade. Through this experience, I have gained an understanding of what it takes to be a leader. I will listen to your concerns and ideas and will and will welcome your input. I want to encourage you to get involved and strive to maintain the long-standing record of excellence at Coleman High School. The support and dedication of our teachers and administration have been essential in the accomplishments of this student body. It will be a privilege to work with these leaders as well as the other elected SGA officers to better serve you. Although I'm running unopposed, I'm asking for your vote. I will be honored to represent the student body at Coleman High School. Thank you for voting for me, Tyler Sugars, Vice President of SGA. Good morning, everyone. Well, I can only imagine the tension and drama in the lives of Hillary Clinton, John McCain, and Barack Obama right now. Our students here have only been campaigning for one week with $75 worth of posters and free food. And I'm sure everyone has felt the tension and stress. I know I felt it, and because I'm a senior, I don't need to get to vote. And, by the way, I haven't got any free food either. I'm here to make your choice for SGA president a little less stressful and dramatic. Well, the CV Bailey is your only choice. You really don't even have any other option. <laughs> That's the beauty of our democratic system. You get to choose who or what you want, but only more than one person cares. <laughs> I can assure you, Stevie does care about the future of the student body here at CHS. Even if she doesn't care about feeding her tall, handsome, brilliant, dedicated, and hardworking campaign manager. <laughs> she wants to be your student body president for all the right reasons, and I think that is a very important quality to leave. She wants to be president in order to make the high school experience of all of you more enjoyable and memorable. She may dress somewhat strangely on occasion, but unlike another female presidential candidate, she does not wear obnoxious yellow pantsuits 24 7, and I think that is a major plus. <laughs> so, whether you're ready or not, whether you like it or not, Stevie Bailey is going to be your next SGA president at Cullen High School, and all of you should take home to that fact. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. As you know, my name is Stevie Bailey, and I will be your 2008-2009 SGA president. As a member of SGA since ninth grade, I understand the responsibilities and duties that are expected of me, and I promise to execute those duties diligently and to the best of my abilities. I am very excited and optimistic about this next school year, and I want all of you to know that you can come to me anytime with any suggestions that you might have. Your opinions are always valued, and I want you guys to be an active part of the school. We have a wonderful school with great traditions, and I will faithfully uphold those traditions and possibly add new ones. I look forward to serving as your 2008-2009 president, and I will do my best to make next year a great year full of fun and amazing memories. Thank you. While everyone is thinking